What was going on then? Yeah, we'll just take, he should just jam pre, but whatever, it's, it's fine. And Queen of Clubs. Ace chat we will be called for, but two pot, see bit. That's a pretty shitty turn. And your man's going in again, so we're definitely falling sevens. Fuck, how did he do that? Gonna try and show this one down. How did he find queens there after going all in every fucking hand? Dear diary, I got lost today. Wasn't fun. Beat Jack, which had the turn, probably do have to pay him in the forward part to be honest. See you. Ah, at least you won twice. <laughs> How'd he go from the UK to Thailand and end up with an Australian accent? Uh, get a min raise here. I guess that the Australian accent is more like a character I put on just to relax while I was first streaming. It just became a thing. I really don't think I'm going to win this pot. I really, really don't think I'm going to win. I mean, I really think I'm going to win. They're beating up in a few pots there. I don't think we can fold sevens when the guy's just ramming every hand. And Ace Jack, she's a forward pot. Like, people are range just so wide. You just, if you look at any kind of sims, like, if they've got any kind of bluffing range, it's just always a call. You know, people rarely do bluff. Check here, we're going to splash pot. Uh, probably can buy with this now. Did it work? Yes. Splash pot. The guy goes eight, I guess. The way you should think about this is like the blinds are like seven and 14. Do I call this, which is a small blind? I guess not with this hand out of position. It's pretty, it's still pretty close. $40, I'm definitely calling. Hey, so I see we call it through it in position. Very, very, very small. So I do think we continue with door backdoor overclock. And now we do start bluffing because we have nada. So 28 looks good. Nah, no, 30. Yeah, we will jam the river. More in, baby. Yeah, what the fuck is that? How does he have queens? First big bluff of the day, boys. I regret nothing. Defended here, multi way. I'm gonna call flop. I'm gonna lead the turn. Do you always put two hundred with seven spray? I don't know how to answer that, buddy. I just showed you the guy with Gemini all in, uh, every single fucking hand. Now, you guys, in another life, I was actually, um, I guess, a management consultant, but I was more of an engineering management consultant. And the, their industry is just full of them, like, basically, like, ripping each other new ones. Like, they do this thing called, like, they have, they give each other, like, really, really tough feedback. And, like, to be honest, it's, like, way over the top and unnecessary. I remember one guy said that he, he thinks I should consider, like, getting a voice coach. Because I would sometimes film videos and presentations, and I speak pretty clearly when I did them, but maybe not as clearly as I should have for like the world to understand. Uh, I remember just getting so mad at that feedback. <laughs> uh, eight seven sued here. We called the button, called the C bet on the flop, and we're going to happily bet. And I was just like, "Fuck this guy." He goes, "Maybe you should consider hiring a voice coach." And I'm like, "You sound like fucking honest, fortunate, you dickhead." They call it tough love sessions. Like no one else in the fucking world does them. Are we going to win a big pot today, boys? Ace King for sure. King Jack. Once, he says. That's a good flop. I'll take the Jack of Hearts just for a little bit more of a sweat. I do not want insurance. All right, King of Hearts. Zoop. No, all mine, buddy. All mine. Nice. Should have ran twice. I don't play foreign zoom anymore. I'm not allowed to play in stars anymore now. I'm with GG. Um, I am gonna be with GG for the foreseeable, but I may ask them about doing some sort of 500 zoom stuff. 
just to kind of keep the you know maybe like once every three videos or something just keep content what people want this is a four bit call the audit if you didn't know that already and this is a C bit now Oh, he's going all in. Yeah, we'll just take, he should just jam pre, but whatever, he's, it's fine. And Queen of Clubs. Nice. Heater is back. King turn, we check flop, we're gonna check call turn. And then we'll go for a tiny value bet on the river. King turn, fives. No good, no good. Jacks, we just defended MP on Z button. Oh, sorry, the big blind. And I'll check again here with the Jack Clubs on the Queen turn. You know, we've already bet the river, same thing. Call with fives. What bands do I like? Uh, when I was at school, I was like always into like alternative rock. Green Day, Fallout Boy, that kind of stuff. Uh, may have induced this. Got a couple of deuces. I have the Jack Clubs here. Now I'm just kind of into anything and anything, like Post Malone, like anything you hear in clubs. I like Pendulum for a while when I was at school. Obviously that's more drum and bass. I like a lot of music. I think I'm going to fold. Where's he from? What country is that? I have no idea. It's got a, got a moon in it. I don't know what country that is. Guess we fold. Jeremy Bluff. I'm close there, but I'm trying to make myself not bluff catch as much because it doesn't seem to be a thing on this site. Splash pot. I'll pay two dollars admission. Thank you for the good lucks. Maybe mic is far away. You can hear you perfectly fine always, but I can see it'd be hard for some people. That's all. Yeah, cool. Anyway, I'm going to turn a queen. I'm not going to pay forty-two dollars. Jack tensed. I'm three bidding. And the flop toppest pair. Oh, I got $400 in that table. Why did I do that? And you're welcome. I'm glad you all guys are enjoying the content. Thank you for tuning in. There's going to be a lot more, actually, a lot more free stuff. My Academy website is launching soon, and I'm giving a lot of this, a fair amount of it away for free. The Ginge Poker video series is now live. Head over to gingepoker.com if you want to start your path to financial freedom. Hope to see you there. As a give back to you guys. Table four, we open check check. We're just going to go big on the turn. And I'm going to over at this river. Jack tends to, I kind of messed up and I thought I was the aggressor in C betting, but so I just stabbed in position, but worked, so I'm a genius. Three betting pocket eights. C betting pocket eights. Then we have the barrel pocket eights here. Plenty of hands and protection that we need. And on the river, there we go, we check fold. He's got the old nine ball, has he? Fair enough. Didn't quite follow what was going on here, but I've turned a queen. So it seems good to bet, right? Don't really know what the action was, because I can't remember if I See bet or not. So I'm checking because I'm a bit nervous. Guess he's not calling that anyway. Uh, H checks to with three bet C bet, and I think we are going to barrel the turn. I'm just thinking about it. Only because I do have a lot of showdown here. So I think I am going to check. And because of that, we can't fold yet. And yeah, now we definitely can't fold the river. Even though we now lose to obviously some two pairs and shit, but. Yeah, we beat King 10, so what are you gonna do? Got him! Now I'm tempted here. I think we do call. So we'll see that next hand everywhere. This guy calling is weird. This guy should slow down a lot with his air balls now. So last hand. I like that if he's got his king to be fair. Cool. So that is the end of the session. Um, thank you for tuning in. The server's obviously going to reset it now, so I want to raid someone before that happens.
All the best, and I'll probably stream later for Russian Cash Fridays, and all the best. Show